Hey, it's Iron Locksmith here. All right, we got your four button Toyota remote. For this task here, you will need a flat tip screwdriver along with your battery. Now these remotes are always fun because they have a tendency when you open them up to come apart. It's just the way they're designed. If you have your key ring on here, you'll want to remove it. Put your flat tip screwdriver in here. And when you do, go ahead and just twist it and she pops open. When it pops open, go ahead and move that housing to the side. And you notice right here, there's a sticky, sticky substance, leave it in there. That's holding the chip in there. If that comes out with the cover over here and a chip comes out, just put that chip back in. That's what starts your card. And if you look, it says use coin to open here. What they're talking about is there's a little indentation right in here. So you wanna turn around, lift up on that. And you'll see that piece comes out. You notice this little rubber piece pops up. You wanna push on them circles and lay the key flush down. We're gonna move it out of the way. If you flip it over, all your buttons will come apart and pop out. Your battery's stored inside here, and when you flip it and you look at the back, it says to use a coin right here. We're gonna use a flat tip, and you will need just a little bit of pressure, and you put it in here, and when you squeeze, she'll start popping up. So let's go ahead and twist it, and you hear it popping up. Twist it right there again. It's open enough for me to get my fingernails in. We'll go ahead and pull it apart. Two halves came open. It shows you your battery, which is a CR 2016. You do have these little metal tabs. Do not pry on that area. You have these little indentations here on the side. That's where the flat tip goes in very nicely. And just lift the battery out. So we'll go ahead and pop her out. Notice the battery come flying out. You don't want to try to pry too far because you get the metal ring. You don't want to pry this in because you'll bust your little tab. We're using a new remote, so we'll put the same battery back in. And when you do, you want to push against there because that's what's going to actually hold the battery in. So we'll slide it in. And you notice it went in. Push down, you'll see the little plastic piece here is now overlapping the battery. Here, here. So we know we're good. You have three corners. Take the two halves, put it back together. And when you do, just gently squeeze it together and you'll notice the little tabs pop in. Once they're popped in, go ahead and take the back and the front half, bring them together. Notice your indentation. You'll notice it only sits in one way. With this here, lift up the key by the blade or the side, don't lift on the bottom. We'll go ahead and set your remote board in, push down gently, and you'll see that it's in. Take the two halves, put them together, gently squeeze it, and they'll snap together. These four buttons are the ones that will like to pop out on you, so just be careful with that. Thanks for watching Sergeant Locksmith, and go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you found this useful. And please post a comment and smash that like button.